Hey guys, so I'm just here to quickly update you on the last two weeks of our lives. It's been kind of crazy, but basically um, we've had Thanksgiving, which was really fun. We celebrated with my in-laws. They drove up from Georgia and my brother-in-law Daniel was able to come as well, which the kids just had such a blast hanging out with him and with Pops and Nana. Um, we also had CJ who came with a friend of his name, John. The reason why David is not with me is because he's very, very sick. I got really sick last week and then basically after that every couple of days more of our children got sick and eventually David and um, but I just wanted to record a quick update. The kids right now have pink eye. I think it's getting better though. There's some ear infections going around and then stomach viruses. So it's just been epically like tragic in the health department. <laughs> um, but as far as just answered prayer, there are two things that we just wanted to say a big thank you for. The first one is we mentioned last time a lot about the weather and um, having the right clothes for these types of temperatures is incredibly helpful. And in the last two weeks, we've just seen God miraculously provide. There's a closet when you first walk into our house that I guess it's like called a mud room. Um, and basically that closet was completely empty. We had nothing to put in it. We had like no winter clothes. And it's only been two weeks and that closet is full. It is full with clothes, guys. God has provided by giving us um, clothes that were completely free that someone just said here I I want to give you this like super nice snow jacket boots um, hats um, God's provided through um, money that um, we've received that we've been able to use specifically for as like a special gift specifically for buying clothes and we went to Goodwill and the Goodwills here actually have warm clothes and we got a ton of clothes for the kids they were able to get a whole winter wardrobe for like pennies, um, pennies to the dollar if we would have gotten it at a department store. Um, Olivia, Olivia is chanting Elmo in the background. <laughs> she wants to watch Elmo. <laughs> okay, okay, Olivia, okay. The last thing I want to share of just gratitude and thankfulness is um, when my dad visited a couple weeks ago, dad and Corey were here, and I was able to share a little bit about my struggles just mental health wise and with darkness and struggling here just being um, feeling very alone and not being part of any groups for homeschooling my kids and basically we talked and brainstormed a little bit about how we can improve that and there's something that the seminary provides here at Southern friends and family gave to fully fund a scholarship for all four of my kids to participate in something called mom's day out which would give me two days a week a couple of hours um, I can put any one of the kids at any time so I'll be able to homeschool my older two kids for a couple hours and then have some time just to myself to just pray and um, be with the Lord and breathe a little. Um, with David in seminary, there's very little breathing room here from being mom 24-7. So I just wanted to share those two like answers to prayer because every time we come on here we share like prayer requests. And every single time without fail, two weeks later when we do another vlog, God has fully answered our prayers like above and beyond what we could have ever asked. So I wanted to share that with you guys because prayer is so powerful and I'm so thankful for each one of you who have prayed for us and who have encouraged us. And um, like, I don't even have any prayer requests right now. Like I guess that the kids would get better and that David would get better. Um, we would use this time in between semesters well. Um, David does have a winter term semester um, that he'll be taking at the beginning of December, but um, but all I can think about is just how thankful I am. I'm so, so thankful for our faithful God. He is so good. And um, even though last night I was up all night <laughs> with kids throwing up and David throwing up and it was not easy, um, there was joy there because our God is so good to us. Even if he gives us nothing, he's given us his son. And um, we're entering a season where we get to celebrate that. And I'm so excited um, to just meditate on Jesus and his birth and him coming to this earth and sacrificing for us. 
which is way harder than me moving a couple hundred miles north to Kentucky, although I like to complain about it all the time. <laughs> um, Jesus did so much more for us when he came down and became man and died after living a perfect life so that we could live, and I'm so thankful. Anyways, I'm super emotional, obviously. Sorry about that, but I just want to say thank you. We're doing great. Every day, we're experiencing God's grace and His kindness and His goodness. And um, So I'm going to sign out now and get back to the kids and to David, but hopefully you enjoy this little recap of our last two weeks, and uh, hopefully we'll get another one up two weeks from now. So, love you guys. See you later. Bye. Yeah, Christmas feel. <laughs> What is going on here? What do do? There's some icicles on my car. Hey! There's icicles! There's a power outage at school, so I get an extra half hour to get to class. I'm gonna see some ice that, that was on that car. Whoa. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh, don't throw it on the ground. Hey! Did you find ice? <laughs> What's going on? It's not raining snow! Take out your tongue so a piece of snow can come on you. <laughs> I caught one. It's actually snowing! You all to see this? It's snowing! <laughs> Let me see your hair. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! That's so it's crazy! <gasps> Oh, my beard? Yeah. Catch the snow beard. Oh. <laughs> much snow. That's crazy. Just like in the matter of minutes, it snowed that much. Oh my gosh, it's so much snow. This is winter! <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this. What have you got in your hand, Solomon? Ducks. <laughs> oh, look, there's the last one. Ah! <laughs> Get it, Daddy! Oh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> We're all gonna fly the back. Oh, Simon! <laughs> I'm on campus this morning because my boy CJ is preaching uh, for his preaching class in the beautiful Baradis Chapel this morning. So uh, I'm going to check him out. I got my coffee and uh, uh, lots of warm clothes because it's still snowy everywhere. Anyway, looking forward to seeing CJ preach.
love uh, surpasses um, racial barriers, surpasses status, surpasses our personalities. Uh, and this love is a gentle love that goes deeper than simply the love that we often see in our world today. Because what unites us, the reason why we love others, our brothers in Christ, even those who are unbelievers, is because of what Christ has done. Is Oli doing that with you with your hands? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Annabelle, show me what you're doing. Do it. Alright, Solomon, count down. Three, two, one. Her face, she looks thrilled. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs>